Eric Borkowski, the head softball coach for the Audubon Wheelers, joining us here tonight after a varsity doubleheader with Missouri Valley. Coach, a, a couple of losses tonight. First one, 13-3 to three in six innings. Uh, you went with Faith Flifflett tonight uh, to start that ball game. Talk about how you thought she threw on the hill. Oh, I thought Faith did an excellent job. Uh, I mean, she did start struggling there in about the fifth, I think, fifth, fourth, fifth inning. Uh, I go out and I ask her if she's tired, and she says, yeah, a little bit. I said, oh, well, thanks for the heads up. <laughs> uh, but I think I thought she did a great job uh, for, for her first varsity start this year. I'm not disappointed one bit. Uh, first game, I thought we played okay. Didn't play our best, but having a new pitcher on the mound kind of makes people a little eerie and don't know how to play because they don't know what the pitcher's going to be like. But I thought Faith did a great job. Talk about uh, the rest of the ball game. How did you feel like you hit against uh, Missouri Valley? Oh, the first game, I didn't think we hit the ball particularly well. But the second game, like I said, we mm -hmm. came out and I thought we just hit the ball really well. But it just happened to be at the shortstop, who probably is their, one of their top players. Oh, yeah. Which, to me, if we didn't hit it to her, who knows what could have happened. But th that's where the ball was hit. So, I mean, we got to go with it. 3-3 three, three ball game going into the sixth inning, kind of a rough inning for you yep. guys uh, that time. But uh, tell you what, club I thought shot some, uh, showed some fight, uh, came back in the bottom half of the inning. Oh, I definitely. Uh, I was just disappointed that we kind of looked like we kind of gave up after they got a couple runs. But when, then when we came back in in the bottom half, I thought we, we fought back well, like you said. And it was just great to see. Uh, so I'm not disappointed in that. It's difficult to get a loss like that, but hey, we played well. Eric, it seems like this year with this club that it, 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 every night you guys are in a game and then one little thing yeah. kind of seems to go the wrong way. That kind of happened in both these games tonight. Definitely. That's one of our things that we've struggled with all year. I mean, yeah, we got a new shortstop with Taylor, uh, but I thought we did well otherwise throughout the field. We got a new outfielder in uh, Caitlin Schultz. She did a great job, but like I said, like, like you said, uh, we get that one inning, and that just hurts us, and we got to get over that going into regionals. How have you seen this team develop? Uh, you got some, as you said, some young players out there getting some valuable experience for you. Definitely. I thought we've experienced well. I was a little worried about our shortstop going into the season. Uh, Timberlake Ford got hurt halfway through the season. I thought she was doing a great job of doing exactly what we needed. And then Taylor stepping in the last few games, she's also doing a great job. So it's great to see these younger girls stepping in when we need them, and Taylor in the outfield started out there and now Caitlin and they they're both playing well I mean great to see like you said the younger girls step in at these different positions and can't be disappointed one bit talk about the veteran leaders and the kind of year that they've had trying to lead some of these younger players oh our seniors that pitcher Katie and Tiff behind the plate they've been together for for years I mean especially at the varsity level for at least the last three years uh, they've done a great job uh, Marissa Hobrick's done a great job helping these girls in situations and even at practice, uh, which is great. Sometimes you don't get that out of your seniors or even juniors, but those girls are helping them out, not yelling a lot, but they're helping them out, which is great. Coach, I appreciate you joining us here tonight. I know you guys got a few games left before regionals, as you said, hard to believe getting underway already next week. That's right. Thank Head you. coach Eric Borkowski again with the Audubon Wheelers. Thank you.